While centralized exchanges currently dominate cryptocurrency trading activity, DEXs or decentralized exchanges are growing in number and popularity around the world. Centralized exchange is a platform where you can buy and sell digital assets such as cryptocurrencies. In these type of exchanges, a third party is used to monitor and secure the transactions on behalf of the user. The blockchain system does not track these deals. These are easy to use and follow all the compliance for a secured and easy trade. Some of the known centralized cryptocurrency exchanges are Binance, Wazirex, Zeppe, CoinDCS, etc. A decentralized exchange is very similar to a centralized crypto exchange. But without a third party intervention, these exchanges do not rely on any third party. The funds in the exchange are stored on the blockchain and peer-to-peer -peer trading is also allowed by these exchanges. There are more than 35 decentralized exchanges functioning globally as of now. And some of them are known names as Uniswap, Airswap, Kyber, Bancor, etc. Let's now look at some basic differences on both of these exchanges. Starting with the security feature, although centralized exchanges have very strict security procedures, they do have a threat from hackers. Decentralized crypto exchanges offer more protection. There is no risk involved with losing one's funds due to such acts, and this is the biggest advantage for DEXs. Most DEXs store data across various servers around the world. Centralized crypto exchanges are more popular than DEXs because they were the first ones to enter the market. When it comes to features, centralized cryptocurrency exchanges provide features such as margin trading, spot trading, portfolio management tools, etc. DEXs do not offer margin trading and they also have limited type of orders. Centralized crypto exchanges have more liquidity to offer as they can execute many types of orders. They even have market makers, while DEXs take time for order matching. Centralized exchanges execute orders in less than a second, while DEXs require a few seconds to match execute the order. Centralized exchanges are regulated, they need licenses to operate and are compliant with the regulatory authorities. In India, most of them do a KYC and other checks. While DEXs are complicated to regulate due to the highly distributed blockchain, the control in the case of centralized exchanges lies with the platform, while here users hold control. The users of centralized crypto exchanges have to pay a certain amount of transaction fees to the exchange for using their services. DEXs require no such transaction fees. On a CEX, if you lose password, you can ask the exchange to reset your password. In case of a decentralized world, if you forget your password and your seed phrase, you cannot reset that password.